Right, uh, a Pibgorn update of sorts. Um, I've now got a couple of reads that work tolerably, at least some of the time. Uh, first I'm going to do it on uh, an Elder read. Um, both these reads I've made. Um, so, the sound's a little bit different. The Elder tend to have a softer sound than the Cain reads, um, as you might expect. Um, although each read's quite individual, you know, you'll get harder sounding elder ones and softer sounding cane ones and so on. The main problem is getting ones that will actually play uh, more or less in tune scale. <laughs> anyway, here we go. <laughs> suppose just the cane is shiny compared to the elder one and the ends blocked with sealing wax sometimes the cane ones you can cut them at the node and they don't need the end blocking this one happened not to have a convenient node and a nice straight piece of cane um, and they use a little rubber o-ring as a bridle and a bit of thread as well and that's the ways you adjust the tuning apart from moving it in and out in the socket that's what Reed sounds like on his own, a bit like an overpowering teddy bear squeak. And uh, the octave range, and that's the elder one. And uh, now I'll switch reeds and I'll play Nosgallan again on the uh, cane reed. <laughs> 